Hey everybody, welcome back to Natural Curlies TV and today I'm showing you how to achieve this sleek cane row or corn row style, so stay tuned. So I'm starting out with my hair a few days old and what I mean by that is um, it's not freshly kind of washed my hair has been styled previously and it's been stretched as you can see it'd be a lot shorter if it was done on freshly washed hair but I like to cane row on stretched hair I find it easier because I don't encounter so many tangles so I'm using a moisturizing butter by Camille Rose some oil my, my own oil mixture which I'll put a link above for that um, some styling tools comb a wide tooth comb and a smaller tooth comb and I'm also using some clips to keep my hair out of the way as you can see here I've started on the what side is that looks like the left side <laughs> okay the left side first of all when I'm parting the hair down the scalp I'm keeping the start of the parting quite narrow and as I part down the scalp it gets wider um, that's the kind of look that I'm going for I don't want the parting just to be kind of equal all the way down I think it just looks nicer when it starts off thin and then gets thicker at this point here I'm also kind of doing a bit of moisturizing so each section that I part off I'm moisturizing adding some water just spritzing it onto my hand before I put it onto the hair because I don't want my hair too wet and then I'm adding my Camille Rose moisture butter to moisturize the hair and then I'm using some oil and as you can see here I am now using my comb I've been using a comb quite a bit this um, year in fact because I wanted to create kind of different styles so that is why but um, yeah I'm using the white tooth comb to comb through the hair if you saw that I used the the finer tooth comb to part the hair I have to apologize because I know I didn't get my head in the right position so you could see me cane room my hand is in the way like the whole time I'm really sorry but basically Kenrowin takes um, practice. I started Kenrowin when I was about 14 years old because my mum basically got sick of me asking her to Kenrow my hair. I always wanted like two side cane rows. Um, and when she got sick of it and I got scared of asking her to do it, <laughs> I decided that I need to learn how to do this myself. And then um, I practiced and I practiced and all of a sudden one day I went I, I did it and I went into school and they're like Cara who did your hair and I said me and everyone was like oh my gosh wow you're so good so um yeah I don't think I've really improved much though since I was 13 but anywho it will do so cane Rowan, I would say always start off with tangle free hair that's why I'm using a comb um to uh detangle my hair what you need to do is um, start off with a small section at the top where you're going to kind of cane row your, cane row your hair. Start with start off with three sections like you would with any other braid. Start plaiting, and then you need to add sections, small sections each time you kind of cross over the hair. I don't know if that makes much makes much sense, but. Um, Maybe I can do another video where I show you properly how to cane row. I will try and get that, do that for you guys because I appreciate that it's not very clear in this one. Okay. through yay finally I treated myself to a seaweed break I love seaweed so much that's my good food dance <laughs> the task at hand so I'm starting off on the right side now before I kind of continue I didn't want to continue um, in the same direction I find it easier to do the left side 
do halfway and then start from the other side and then make my way towards the middle. I don't know why, but I just find it easier doing it like this. Um, so yeah, again, cane rowing. So um, yeah, I look quite miserable in this picture and I rolled my eyes up. Oh my goodness me, I must be listening to something because I don't understand why I'm rolling my eyes up. <laughs> something obviously wasn't amusing me. This is the first time I have properly cane rowed my hair in the last two years. I actually love cane rowing and whenever I wear cane rows, I feel like I'm connecting with my true self and my ancestors because this is the form of hairstyles that they would wear. Um, cane rowing dates back to ancient Africa and you would see kind of the Egyptians wearing, black Egyptians wearing um, cane rows so it's a form of even expression as well status age relationships um cane rowing is just more than a hairstyle it has so many factors to it so i'll click my fingers and i'm all done look at this i'm all finished um yeah i'm going to show you how cane rows are for all occasions not just for cultural appropriation or for sports this is me raving it up. So yeah, if I was going raving, <laughs> which I don't do very much of now, um, I would wear my hair in cane rows. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. And I don't think you should think there's anything wrong with it either. So um, it can look sexy on the dance floor. So rock your cane rows when you go raving. You can also wear your cane rows to work. I wore my cane rows to work. Um, I think I had one person in my workplace said that they liked my hair and I could tell I was being looked at but maybe they didn't think it was appropriate but I it is who I am it is my culture to wear cane rows so nothing you can do about that or you can be what everyone thinks you are going to be and that is ghetto with cane rows um <laughs> this is a joke by the way don't take me seriously yeah some people have this idea that cane rows are ghetto but they are definitely definitely not that if you look back through history you will see that cane rows were worn by african royalty okay so let's just get that straight um or you can just wear cane rows and be yourself this is me with my small earrings on and me just being me i hope you have enjoyed this video guys please subscribe to natural curlies if you haven't done already and if you like this video do me a favor thumbs it up and let me know that you liked it okay and i have a new channel called becoming cara so check that out take care love to you all bye bye